Do you look at the market in, the, in terms of competitors? Because there must have been similar products out there, right? So what, what did you see when you did the research? And then why did you decide that there was still an opportunity here for you to build something? You know, in our space, uh, the two uh, biggest competitors uh, were Gong and Chorus, right? Even at that point in time. Um, but both of them, you know, uh, when we started looking at the space in 2017, were still relatively, um, you know, early stage companies. And the concept of, uh, you know, conversation intelligence and how do you use this data and what do you use it for was also relatively early at that point, right? So what we felt was, one, nobody had a clear thesis or understanding of uh, how to use this data. And we felt that, you know, the winner wasn't just because somebody decides to record calls and transcribe them because, you know, recording of calls has existed uh, for at least, you know, a few decades, uh, right? We felt that the real innovation or, you know, where the business needed to be built was in identifying the right use case for the data and being able to make sure that you're able to deliver that value uh, quickly. And we felt that that was not answered. Um, when we started building this out. And, you know, when we were trying to validate whether or not that was answered, we went and also spoke to some of the customers who were using the competitor's products because we wanted to understand, like, hey, if you're using this today, does it solve everything for you or are there still gaps? And through that process, we identified that there were definitely things people were struggling with. Uh, And I think that was also an important learning in just knowing that, you know, what people say they will do in an ideal world versus what people do uh, is dramatically different, right? Like, I know we are all familiar with New Year resolutions and how they land up. Um, And that was exactly the case with sales coaching, where, you know, I think the products were built on a promise of saying that, hey, sales managers are motivated to do sales coaching, and I will build a tool to help them do sales coaching better. But the fundamental problem was that sales coaching doesn't happen as often as people would like. 